Hi, we are going to start, Chapter 11, Work and Energy of Class 9. In this chapter, we will discuss the concept of work, energy, and power. Numericals related to every topic, will also be covered. Let us start with work. In science, what is work? Do you know that? Work done by a force, on a body, depends on two factors. First, force exerted on the body. And second, distance moved by the body, in the direction of force. Therefore, work is said to be done, when a force exerted on a body, and in that body is displaced, in the direction of force. Let's understand, the concept of work, with some examples. Push a pebble lying, on a surface. The pebble moves through a distance. You exerted a force on the pebble, and the pebble, got displaced from point A, to point B. In this situation, work is done. Let's take one more example to understand the concept of work. A girl pulls a trolley, and the trolley moves through a distance. The girl has exerted a force on the trolley, and it is also displaced from point A, to point B. Therefore, we can say that, work is done. The important concept is to memorize that, distance is to be covered, in the direction of, force. Hence, work done in moving a body, is equal to, the product of force exerted on the body, and the distance moved by it, in the direction of force. Work, is equal to, force, into, distance. And, SI, unit of work is joule. Or, 1, Newton meter. If the body is displaced in the same direction of force, the work is done by a force. If the displacement is against the force, the work done against the force. If the displacement is perpendicular to the direction of force, work done is zero. Now, how will you define one joule? When a force of one newton, moves a body through a distance one meter, in its own direction is known as one joule. Hope you understand the concept of work. In next video, we will do some numerical related to work, Till then, goodbye.